So getting set for race number five from Red Source in Charlottetown this afternoon. Uh, they swing in behind the Metro Home Building setting, starting gate uh, Vance, Sonny Rankin Memorial. We were lucky enough to meet Sonny a couple of years ago, and we're certainly thinking of him today. A true gentleman and a great horseman. Up to you for the call. Words well spoken, Mr. McPhee. Sonny Rankin Memorial lines up here in the fifth. E. Gamer, the great Maelstrom, Harbor Light, Jerry, Goodeye, Hawkeye, Bankshot, Hanover. Jeb, Mick Dundee, Black Dan, top of the stretch. Here they come. Rough and pacing, good eye, Hawkeye, Mick Dundee, and on the rail, that's E. Gamer. Between horses comes Hammer Light, Jerry, and a cavalry charge around the turn, led by E. Gamer, way out there, Mick Dundee. In between them is good eye, Hawkeye, third, and it's showtime at Charlottetown, going to the opening quarter, and the farthest out, Mick Dundee, the leader. Second is Good Eye Hawkeye. E Gamer now third. That's the Great Maelstrom fourth. Harbor Light Jerry's in fifth. Then sixth is Bankshot Hanover. Jeb seventh. And the trailer. That's Black Dan. 28 and one. Opened it up. And that's Mick Dundee for Donnie McNeil. And they were spent hard. Deleted. Second is Good Eye Hawkeye. E Gamer in third. The Great Maelstrom. Coming to the outside, fourth, following out fifth. That is Harbor Light Jerry. Now in sixth is Bankshot Hanover. Seventh is Jeb, trailing the field. That is Black Dan, the road of the half in 57 and four. Mick Dundee will lead him around the turn, going to the 5 8. Good Eye Hawkeye is second from the outside, third. That's the great maelstrom. Harbor Light Jerry dropped in fourth. Now it's E Gamer fifth. Bankshot Hanover, the outside, sixth. Jeb is seventh, and the trailer, that is Black Dan. They're over to three quarters next. Mick Dundee is the leader. The great maelstrom on the outside, second, right there in the pocket. Good eye, Hawkeye, third. Harbor Light Jerry going wide, fourth. Fifth is E Gamer. Three quarters up in one. 27 and three. They turn for home, led by Mick Dundee. In at the rail, Good Eye Hawkeye is second. Harbor Light Cherry on the far outside. Deep stretch now. Mick Dundee. Good Eye Hawkeye and Campbell get there on the end of it. Second is Mick Dundee and a host of horses in the show photo. 156. Four. Well, a great start and a great finish here to the Sunny Rankin Memorial here in race number five. They were shooting off the gate here today. Mick Dundee and Good Eye Hawkeye, they both wanted the lead. E Gamer was even tracking with them early on here. Donnie got there, but like Van said, paid a little bit of a price. 28 and 1. Mark tracks in the two hole, 57 and 4. They raced the backside, 127 and 3. They're going to settle it in the stretch here now. Donnie trying to hang on in the middle with Mick Dundee. Mark coming down the passing lane late, and he's got a lot of pace here with good eye Hawkeye and he's going to get there in the end and reach up to get it all 156 and four he's a winner Mick Dundee all the road work he raised really well he's in for second tight for third looks like the five yeah it's posted bank shot Hanover third so uh, we'll see good eye Hawkeye and Campbell in the winner's circle in just a moment it is the Sunny Rankin Memorial Todd Weatherby and uh, Tammy Johnson they did a lot of work on this here this afternoon they'll be trackside for the cooler presentation Good Eye Hawkeye arriving at the fifth race winner's circle. Bay pacing, Gelding, he's six by, oh, what do you say? Off the dragon again, damn Don Gally out of bed. 
Owned by Kyle Wilkie of Sherwood and Shelley Wilkie of Stratford, Kyle does the training. Mark Campbell's second winner on the day for the double, 156 and 4, the time of the mile. Good eye, Hawkeye. Here in the fifth, down at trackside, the Sunny Rankin Memorial. Cooler presentation.